Having gone auto tracking, we're now on a mission to unlock the stinky secrets of their poo. It's time for science to reveal what our otters have really been eating. Okay, Tina, so how do we analyze otter brains? So first, we need to prepare them. Usually, we would soak the otter brains in a special alcohol called ethanol. This actually helps to preserve them. But since our samples are fresh and ready to go, let's get started. Okay, let's do this. So let's grab the seed and the samples and head over to the sink. Okay. Now our samples are ready for analysis, so let's pour them into the tray for sorting. Right. So, just based off of the samples, are we able to tell what type of fish the otters are eating? Well, the clue is in the fish scales. So they are like little identity tags and they are unique to each fish. So you can take a scale and look at it under the microscope to see what patterns and what fish they belong to. Okay, I'm just going to guess based on the shape and the colour. Uh, I think it's this one. You see the shape, it's quite similar in the colours. What do you think? Yes, I think you got the right fish. Good okay, job! Okay, I've got the right fish. Cool. So, now that we've identified what type of fish the otters eat, can we also tell from the samples how much fish otters consume in a day? Well, we can't do that, but just by looking at these samples, we can tell that these otters probably have a 100% fish diet. Otters eat about 25% of their body weight each day, so this means that they are excellent hunters underwater. So you can imagine them gliding through the water like very little Joseph schooling. Furry little Joseph Schoolings. That's yep. a way to put it. Okay. 